Friend me, friend me, any me. All these next next just wanna be a mini me. All these next next just wanna. But if a voice inside you tells you that you don't know how to paint, start painting and let that voice be silenced. I think that's what Van Gogh said. Anyway, hello guys and welcome to another episode of Moments. My name is Ms. Drew and I am going to paint. I know you think I look cute in my smart student outfit. Well, come along with me and let's see how it goes. Uh, I'm about to go go cool. Leave my head is red. Hello. Yeah, trying to get the this like it's is so my beautiful teacher for today. today. Her name is Ernestina and she's going to bring out the inner Van Gogh in me. I'm so excited. How are you? Good, good. So today, what have you got in store for us? So today we are painting this. Oh wow, oh, guys, I think I can do this. As an artist, I've been painting for over four years now. Yeah, we have uh, Boaz, who is Lebanese. She started it and then we are, um, she has artists as an art instructors for these kind of programs. So we have professional artists. Oh, nice. Okay, so today you're going to be helping me. Yes. I'm excited. by giving you the first half of the paint because I'm the only one here do the first half then we go through easily you and your status walking like that it's really getting too much but I can't so we can put all our brushes into the water and then let's take the smaller brush dry it off on the tissue And then we'll come up here about three inches from the bottom of your canvas. Then you mark slightly into the canvas, just a little. Okay. Then on the opposite side, we create the same line of the same length, like that. Okay, so now we're going to double the line. We'll come up a little and then draw another line. Same length as the first and you repeat the same step on the other side. Okay, so now we're going to draw our our door okay so you just draw the straight line from the top towards the bottom so you just square it up but it shouldn't reach the very top of the canvas you should give it about another three inches or two so you just create the door in there like that to the bottom now, Okay, so one trick, your bristles are soft, so you just apply a little amount of pressure. Yes, it's fine. Don't, don't apply too much pressure, else it would give you very thick lines. So you just take your time. So you should have something like this. I wish I could change a different colour. You know, I want it to be a little bit more artistic and change the colours, but it's fine. Yellow. Hmm. I don't think I like my brush, so don't judge my ending. 
<laughs> I'm not making an excuse. Perfectionist. A bit jealous. <laughs> When you get techniques with the brush, that's how Van Gogh does it. I really don't want to paint it green. Okay, so I've got the purple. Ask and you shall receive. Knock on the door, the purple door, and it shall be open. <laughs> Lego. Yes, this is what I'm talking about. I think this was an easy one to paint. Well, to be fair, I just love the fact that we're getting taught step by step how to do it. <laughs> I'm taking this seriously because this is my favourite colour. There's a pot, there's a tree. There is not enough space on my board for the extras. Oh gosh. Wow. Yes, thank you. Teacher's pet. <laughs> okay. This is pressure. Oval. Okay. Hey, does this even look like a circle? Is it gay? Okay. I don't want to ruin it. Do we colour the pot? Do we colour it? Yes, let's finish with that. Okay. Really cute for a date. You know, first date you go painting. That would be really nice if I had a man. <laughs> I do my handles already. Okay, let me add the, the apple dots. No, it didn't work. It's not visible. Hey, well this is a pretty painting. I mean it looks much better than mine. Very artistic actually. How long have you been painting for? Uh, for 10 years now. 10? I'm still in. No, I think, well done. You've, you've done well. You've done well. Do you usually come to one art classes? This is my first time. Really? Yeah. So you usually just paint at home? Yeah, I, I just try my hand. Oh, okay. I see. Okay, so we've got two over here. I mean, you guys came together. Is it a date? First date? Yeah. What did I see? Paint, wine and art, painting, dates are cool. <laughs> Look at these. Okay, these are cool. These look nice. So who won the competition out of the two of you? I think he did. Well, I think it looks really cool. Oh, guys. Everyone did better than me. I'm a little bit jealous, actually. <laughs> 
look good. Okay, I like this different door that you've got over here. These different artistic doors. Okay. Do you guys come painting often? Yeah. Oh, nice. So you see, nice hobbies for you guys to do in Accra. Come and do some painting with some art, with some relaxing music. So many things to do in Accra. So I'm here with Abigail, supervisor of Cocoon. I mean, thank you so much for inviting me today. I mean, I've had such a great time. The food, the drinks, the service, everything was absolutely superb. Now, I mean, Abigail, tell us how long has Cocoon been around for? Cocoon has been here for three years. Wow. Three years now, yeah. Okay. In May, it will, be, it will be like three years in May. Okay, so what kind of people usually come to Cocoon? We normally get the foreigners, I mean, white okay. people, and most of the blacks too. They normally come here. But honestly, I usually come here for their breakfast. Their breakfast is absolutely amazing. But today, I did something different. Today was you know, wine and art. So, I mean, why did you decide to, you know, collaborate and do wine and art? Because it's like, since like I've seen them coming here to do this artwork, it has really made me as an individual very creative. Oh. Yeah, because like how they, they do the paintings and everything, it's really beautiful. We have workspaces, like in case if you want to do any event to, like you can contact us and then you will like host that event for you. Maybe birthdays, anything at all. Thank you so much. I mean, this was amazing. I'm definitely going to be back again. I've had an amazing time in Cocoon located in Osu. If you are looking for a workspace, chilling, brunch, wine and art, then obviously Cocoon is the place for you. I'm out. did I do this is my teacher so teacher I'm a student how well did I do you did very well really out of 10 I'll give you 11 hey can you you see that I yes. told you I was bringing out my inner Van Gogh <laughs> yes so the painting session has been complete I mean it was a success I enjoyed myself how long have you been doing wine and art it's been three years three years, three years. nice three years in this um, particular place Cancun no no Three years all over, we do private events too, from birthday parties, bachelorettes and corporate events. We just call us and then we show up. Nice! So I mean, what even inspired the whole wine and art? So it was sip and paint all over, like the US and then the UK, so many people have fun with it. So since it's a very fun way to distress, why not bring it to Ghana? Mm, definitely I was able to de-stress. I think it was very therapeutic. Very. There is there. How many people do you usually get coming to the classes? Today was full. Yes. Usually we don't call it a class. Oh. To take off the whole official thing. Or yeah. Formal thing. It's all fun. So it's a session. Session. Yes, because yes, people were here on dates. Right. Birthday parties, girls catch up. So I think this is definitely a good um, idea. Do you always paint this door? No, no, no. Every, <laughs> every, every session and it's... Um, theme or it's painting yes. it's different nice so if anybody wanted to you know hire you or you know wine and art for their wedding bachelorette or whatever how do they contact you we're on social media um, especially Instagram wine and art just type art wine and art and then we can get to so us. art wine and art yes okay and you're all over across so is it weekly or monthly or we're yet to start our own sessions we, uh, we, have to, we plan to do it quarterly, yeah, so every few months. But then, just call on us anytime, anywhere. Sure. Amazing. Well, I'm about to find somewhere for my new 11 out of 10 
piece of art. Yes. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. This, of course, was another episode of Moments to the Girl Miss Drew. And I'll see you at my next adventure. <laughs>